Hey everyone, coming at you for another Tohu Toy Friday. And I have a question to pose, which is what is the edgiest uh, Tohu item or Henshin transformation jingle? There's a whole bunch of evil ones out there. The easy ones to point to would be Kamen Rider Chronicle and Oma Geo for being the ones that just really play it straight. Just, you know, scary voice, serious sound effects. Then you bump that up a notch to something like um, Evolt, the Evil Driver, and Genmu's more recent stuff, Genmu Muso and, uh, oh, what's it called? Hyper Fumetsu, those ones, which obviously they demonstrate he's the bad guy, but more than anything, they're very dramatic and egomaniacal, you know, very uh, mustache twirly, if you will. But are they really edgy? Do they really have that, like, drama to them to be the, the ones where it's like, oh boy, this one, <laughs> this one's dark. And I think I have an answer for you, so uh, come with me and check out what I think are the two edgiest common uh, Rider toys and the edgiest henshin jingles to go with them. We start off with something that's just evil for evil's sake. Is it overblown? Absolutely. But it still sort of fits into that realm of like, dramatic but dark. But then... Then we upgrade. overblown metal screaming. Ah. So good. Or maybe something emo that literally turns the world Upside down is a better candidate. And if that's not uh, doom and gloom enough, it also includes suffering. So those are my two submissions, if you like. And I'm curious what you think. Do we go more on the, the dramatic emo <laughs> angsty side with uh, Hell Rising Hopper? Or do we go to the full-blown 
you know, drama, like Disney villain song energy of Gyro Dragon with its pipe organ and its heavy metal. <laughs> That's the best way I can describe it. Just, you know, it's, it's metal rock type vibes that nothing else really seems to have. I can't decide. I think it's both of them for different reasons, but happy Toka Toy Friday and let me know what you think.